Humble and hungry. Humble and hungry. Humble and hungry. Until we see the morning sun, sun, so give us room to do our things. We ain't come to hurt no one, one. So everybody come and get up on the floor now and grab some one. Man, first of all, I'm a boss. I just wanna get that across. Man, even my dentist hates when I'm lost. Pull up to the club in a pen and it's a Porsche. Garbage back for one of the windows, spray painted doors with the flames on them. Michigan plates and my name's on them, baby. Shady's here, come and get him if you games want him. But he ain't stupid, so we're trying to run them games on him. He's immune to Cupid, why you trying to put your claims on him? Cause you Family, one, two, three. Family. I feel like I'm in the best shape I've ever been in. You know, I feel faster, I feel stronger. I feel like I can jump higher. Everything's been going well so far. We've been through three straight months of hard, intense workouts. Casey has definitely made a difference. We can see it in our bodies, on and off the court. Uh, we can see it in our speed, definitely. and agility drills, of course, that'll translate into making hard cuts, uh, being able to push the ball in transition, uh, we do box jumps. Obviously, that'll help us rebound, and getting off the floor quicker and stuff like that. So, Casey has, does know what he's doing. I feel like, physically, I'm in the best shape that I've been in since I've been in college. So, um, everything that we've been doing, you know, is hopefully gonna translate onto the court. Um, so, I feel really good. Physically and mentally, we're in a really good place to uh, do some big things this year. Just waiting on that moment, waiting on my moment. It's always pushing us to the limit, uh, never letting us rest. Well, whenever we think is our strongest point, he's always pushing us over that. So I mean, he's always there for us, always in our ear, We're trying to be better. You know, our season last year went 9 and 21. He reminds us that all the time. We never want that feeling again. To never say that we can't do something. He's always been saying, you know, if you're tired, you just push through it and see what happens. And that'll be the exact same way in a game. In the game, you'll get tired and. You gotta push through it, and when we all decide to do that, that's when we'll be great. And that's what he's really been harping on, and that's what will help us win ball games. You're stronger and you're, and you're faster and you're more explosive. I mean, that, that goes hand in hand with the sport of the game of basketball. If your team can be stronger and faster and, and work hard and, and weight room and, and produce good results, and, and, and that'll help you win, win basketball games. It's a huge deal, it's a big priority to have that kind of relationship with your strength and conditioning coach. Um, we, we work hand in hand all year long from off season to preseason to, to in season. And for us to be on the same page is of high importance. We do have the trust of one another. I trust him and he's done a really good job with our guys so far.
It's a very physically demanding game, and uh, you know, from guards to bigs, there's a lot of different um, needs that each position meets. You know, guys who are 6'10 have different kind of needs, different kind of levers than guys who are 5'10. So we're going to treat everyone's body a little differently. You know, Coach Thomas really wanted to see the guys bigger and stronger and, and faster. So we really emphasis not only on uh, making sure we're you know, preventing injuries, but also that guys have the size on them you know, to withstand the kind of physical demands that they're going to have in practice. Coach Thomas likes his practice very physical, so I want to make sure guys are able to compete through those practices, guys aren't too beat up afterwards. You know, when we play guys in the season, we want to make sure that you know, we're physically ready to go out there and battle with anyone, bang with anyone. So, you know, that was another big emphasis that I know the uh, men's basketball staff here had for uh, their team and the vision they wanted their team to kind of be with. It's very valuable for guys to see the kind of changes in their body that you know happen over time when you commit to training consistently, eating the right things, taking care of your body. You know, it, it's really nice. It's rewarding for them, and uh, it's something that you know now that we they'll they'll have for the rest of their lives, and they'll be able to show their kids, their grandkids, the kind of changes they made.